Hi, welcome to an Onshape video tutorial. I want to do that handlebar exercise in Onshape. I've already imported the start step file and let's do some filled surfaces. Okay, so let's go for a full surface. Should be over here. Fill. I want to fill these two arcs. Then this profile here. Another one here. And the last one. here. Confirm. Now I want to use an offset surface. So go for offset surface from this one. The other direction that should be maybe 20. And another one. With this one. Direction is okay. 40. And I want to delete this. I want to make an extrude here because it will give me a better surface. If I do it the same way as in the other programs, uh, the surface is not as good. You can try, but you will see. So I might even delete this one. And I will go for an extrude here. Okay. So for an extrude, I will need a sketch on that plane. Let's include those two arcs. Close that one and go for an extrude surface here. Surface, a new one, yes. And I want to use these elements, but the other way around. And confirm. So that would be the extrude, let's rename it. Let it it's an extrude, extrude one. So it's easy to find if I need it. I need another plane, so go for a plane. Go for maybe a plane point. This plane is reference, and that point here. Okay, another sketch right there. Again, include those arcs. Confirm. Now let's make an extrude with that sketch here. The other direction should be surface. And you have to select it once more. That's OK. And let's go for 20. OK. And that's the second extrude. Now I need a sketch on the front plane. That would be a line. Vertical. Give it a dimension of maybe 40. And the origin should be the midpoint of that line. Confirm. Now I can go for a sweep. It should be a surface, a new one, yes. I want to sweep this profile along this path. And confirm. And that would be the trimmer. Let's call it Trim Tool. Rename Trim Tool. Trim Tool. Here, that's the Trim Tool. OK, I could split those surfaces and then go for a sweep. But maybe, just maybe, hide those surfaces and do the sweep. I want to sweep that profile 
let's sketch one yeah so let's go for a sweep surface i want to sweep this profile along this path here that doesn't work that's amazing so i have to go the other way around A surface the path would be the same but the other way around and then it works that's sort of strange but it is like it is confirm that would be my pipe one And I want to go for an offset surface of zero from this one, so I have a copy of this part. Or I could transform it by zero as a copy. But I want to do with an offset, I want to have an offset of that surface here, of this one. Oh, that's a fillet. Where is the offset? Sorry, there's the offset of that pipe and it should be a zero offset so this would be pipe two i want to trim pipe two so let's hide pipe one i want to split it with the surface here that's tool sorry i want to split this surface now yeah that's type two and i want to split it with the trim tool keep the tools and confirm let's take a look yes i want to add this side and i want i want to split once more i want to split this surface here with that plane confirm and i want to add this and this should be renamed to half pipe okay now Let's hide the half pipe. Hide not the trim tool, but bring back our fill surfaces because I want to trim those and those extrudes as well. Let's see. I don't need to trim this one. That would be surface one that should go. And same with that one. That surface. okay let's hide this but now I can split I want to split this surface here that surface this surface with that one and confirm And of course, I want to hide some. This should be hidden. That should be hidden. This should be hidden. And I want to split this one with that plane. So go for another split. This object with that plane here and confirm and let's hide this half here yeah and i could hide my trim tool as well and let's bring back the half pipe like this yeah 
Now I want to go from this edge to those edges here and to that one and this should be the rails. These should be the rails. And of course I want to split this one as well. So let's bring back the trim tool. And another split. I want to split this one with the trim tool as well. And let's hide this side. Okay. Okay, so let's go for the loft surface as soon as you select the edge and maybe first hide those planes like this go for the loft select the edge and, this, and the surface and as soon as you go for the edge it will switch to add kind of annoying go back to new now that sh should be an edge open this up go here and select the rest if possible that small one, yeah. Minimize. Now go for the edge of that fill. Yeah. So that would be the edge of the fill. This one. Open this up, go here. And select again the edge of the fill. Go here, select the edge of the fill, go down below and select the edge of that fill. Minimize that and go to this edge here. That would be the edge of the extrude. Now I want to add guides. So let's see if this guide works. And that guide. Okay. Let's open this up. Go for match tangent. Yes. Match tangent. Yes. Works. And let's try here as well. Match tangent. Yep. And match tangent. Yeah, great. And confirm. Yeah, this looks okay. Yeah, now I could hide this. And now I want to do this part here. Okay, let's bring back, I think it's pipe 2. Yeah, because it, we have no trim command. We have a split command. In this case, it's, uh, yeah, okay. Now, I don't know if I can use a loft or should I go for a sweep? If I go for a sweep, let's take a look what the sweep will do. Go for a surface. Try to select that edge. That's not really possible. So go for select other edge of fill and add another edge of fill like this then go for the sweep path and I want to use new those edges mm, this works quite well so I want to do it with that sweep why not and confirm now I could, of course, merge those with uh, the Boolean operation, which is now possible. So select all those surfaces. Is that already there? That's a half pipe, surface 18, surface 17. I'm not quite sure. Let's try it once more. It should be this surface here. The loft, the half pipe, then this one, 
and that one yeah and confirm and now I should hide all other surfaces okay now I want to mirror that one looks pretty good by the way uh, so go for mirror I want to mirror that part yes and the mirror plane would be the front plane in this case confirm to another boolean operation this one and that one and confirm and I'm done so hope this was helpful hope you enjoyed it if you did please give it a like or leave a comment if you want to see more please give it a like or leave a comment please subscribe to my youtube channel please subscribe to my facebook app fan page would be very nice of you I want to get more likes and subscriptions over there as well. Thanks for watching. See you to the next one. Bye bye.